How's it going everyone? <clears throat> so in this video, I'm going to talk about do HIIT workouts really work? So before I get started, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I do appreciate the support. Helps my channel grow. Please follow me on Instagram, Dillenberg999. So do HIIT workouts really work? What do HIIT workouts stand for? HIIT stands for High Intensity Interval Training. Basically what a HIIT workout is, is doing something of high intensity for say 30 seconds to a minute and then taking a rest for say 30 minutes to a minute. Now you're training with high intensity. That's why whatever you do intensity wise will only probably be for 30 seconds to a minute. You're not gonna do high intensity for 30 minutes straight. So for each set or each time that you do the hit, um, again, you're gonna do about 30 seconds to a minute followed by about 30 seconds to a minute of rest. Now with rest, it's good to actually not just sit there and rest, it's good to like do a little walk, for example, if you're doing cardio. So do, does HIT, does it actually work? 100%, not only does it work, but it's actually more effective, studies have shown that it's more effective than doing um, LIS, which stands for low intensity steady um, state cardio which just basically means like walking for two hours or doing a slow jog for two or three hours. The reason why it works is number one, the high intensity. Doing stuff at 90 to 100% intensity is what burns calories extremely quickly. The reason why it works too is it doesn't take long to do a HIIT workout. Anyone can do a 20 minute HIIT workout. Not a lot of people have time to do say one to three hours of cardio a day. So it can be a little bit tricky to do um, the long cardio if you don't have time. But with HIIT, you can do it literally. Um, it, it's very convenient way of doing it. Another thing that people don't talk about is what happens to your body after you're done working out. Now with, uh, with slow steady state cardio, what happens is your body, your metabolism isn't really raised that much after your workout. With high intensity interval training, your metabolism is skyrocketed after you have trained. Now, what does metabolism have to do? Why does that even matter if we're talking about our workouts? Because we just said that calorie wise, high intensity is probably better de depending. I mean, obviously, if you go for a three hour jog, you're going to burn more calories than a 20, um, 20 minute hit session. But if you do 20 minute hit versus one hour of slow, steady cardio, chances are the hit is going to burn more calories. But what does the metabolism have to do? What does that have to do after the workout? Metabolism just means how fast your body is going to be burning those calories. So if after the workout, your metabolism is skyrocketed for the next 24 hours, you're going to be able to eat more food. And on top of that, the food that you eat, it's going to be burned off more quickly, just, which just makes losing weight so much more easier, you guys. So a HIIT workout, HIIT Workouts do work. They work actually extremely effective. And I did hit, I've done hit for so long for my cardio sessions. I love it. I just love doing them. And personally, that's what I do. So I end the video. Thank you so much for watching.